Hi guys and welcome to this uh, quick tutorial using my new mermaid stack glitters and today I'm going to be using sea nymph. I'm also using some fine netting in mint and angel paper in oyster. So first of all I'm attaching the practice tip to my gel stirrer using my blue tack and then I'm using CJP cherry blossom starting at the cuticle area and just pulling down the nail because I'm going for a faded tip today. Then coming in with my crystal glass and then taking the fine netting and laying it over the tip. To stop it moving around I'm just going to use a bulldog clip just to keep it in place underneath and it keeps it weighted so it attaches itself to that base layer of acrylic. Then I'm going to use a small bead of clear acrylic, dab it into the glitter and then I'm going to place that along the line where the netting joins. And I'm just going to make a nice S shape with that glitter and then using my brush picking up the shards of angel paper that I've cut and placing that along one side and patting down. Excuse my dog jumping around in the background there. And once I'm happy with that angel paper and where the glitter is, I'm just going to add a little bit over the angel paper so you get more of a blend together. A little bit on the tip. And then I'm going to cap the entire nail in crystal glass. So starting at the cuticle area and then slowly working my way down the nail. Pulling that forward if this was on a client I'd obviously now be working on my structure making sure I get that apex in and get the shape I want. So blending that second bead up before pulling it down the nail. Making sure all the glitter goes a nice matte colour and that way I know that it's all been covered by the acrylic. So just getting that last little bit on the tip there. And then a quick look at the entire nail to make sure I'm happy. Make sure I haven't missed any little bits. So now it comes to filing off, so I'm just going to use my scissors to cut off that excess netting. And then I'm going to file that nail into shape. And when I'm happy with that, I'm just going to dust it off and then I'm going to use my CJP LED top coat. So I'll do a layer of this and then I'm going to cure in my LED lamp for 60 seconds. And then there's the finished design. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you've got any questions or comments, just pop them below. And if you'd like to see anything else, just uh, request it below. So thanks for tuning in, guys. Bye.